Learn to save a life this season. Every week in the UK, 12 people die under the age of 35 from heart problems. The FAW and Welsh Hearts aim to change that. We're working together with the aim of putting a defibrillator in every football club in Wales. You may be able to save a life if you start effective CPR quickly and use a defibrillator. Here's Johnny Williams and Will Volks to demonstrate how it's done. Check to make sure the area is safe to approach and that you're not in any danger. Hello, you okay? Hello, can you hear me? Talk to Hello? the casualty as you approach and try to get a response. Check the mouth is clear and tilt the head back to keep it clear. Put your ear over the casualty's mouth and check for breathing for 10 seconds. If the heart has stopped, the casualty won't be breathing normally. Call 999. He's not breathing, John. Ring an ambulance, mate. Okay. Try and find a defib. Public access defibrillators are now widely available for anyone to use. Send someone to get one. Start CPR, pump the chest 30 times, followed by two breaths. If you're unable or unwilling to give breaths, continue with the compressions only. Attach defib pad to patient's clear chest. Yeah. Attach defib pad to patient's clear chest. Shock the casualty as soon as possible using the public access defibrillator. The defibrillator will tell you what to do and will only shock if it's needed. Shock advised. Don't touch patient. Press flashing shock button. Stand clear. Stay clear. Shock delivered. Start CPR. The defibrillator is fully automatic and will not do any harm. After two minutes, the defibrillator will prompt you to shock again if needed. Carry on CPR until the casualty shows signs of life or the paramedics arrive. It takes guts and determination to have a go. Anyone who has a cardiac arrest will die unless you start effective CPR. Will you? You've got nothing to lose. You may save a life this season.